this is going to be for my tarot card readers only my intuitives okay the message that i am getting you have been i don't want to say cho yeah you've been chosen for something okay maybe they're still debating it to be a part of a group this has to like i said this is from tarot card reads but these people don't want you on this group or in this group but there's somebody that's over them that it's, it's kind of like they're wanting to add tarot card readers to whatever this group is okay but like i said these people feel like they already got their group they don't need you and cool my thing is you didn't even apply for this what i'm picking up for my collective readers you did not apply for this okay so i don't know how this came about uh it, it could be causing some disruption in your life and you didn't even ask for it so let's see y'all We're gonna start with these oracles right here. <coughs> yeah, I don't know. Cause you can't what I'm picking up, you can't even apply for nothing like this. It has you have to come um like you have to be recommended or something like that. But anyway, this is gonna be very specific. It's for my readers, for my high priestesses. Okay, okay. And I'm even getting high priestess in the hierophant. A high priestess and a hierophant. And y'all know I was picking up on that for a long time. There for a minute. So let's see. That's that's the high priestess card, deep knowing. So here you are, this owl. My tarot card readers, my intuitives, my mediums, my psychics, my clairvoyants. This is you, right? You heard my son. Oh my God. Uh, you could be getting on these people nerd. <laughs> they don't want you, child. And here's the thing. Y'all didn't, like I said, you didn't, you did not even apply for whatever this is. Okay. So with this moon, so here you are sitting on top of the moon. They go spirit space. But there's some moon, there's a moon behind you. Okay. And this is what I'm getting. You did not apply for this. A lot of y'all don't even know that this is going on. But I do feel like it's causing a little bit of disruption in your life. Because you have this deep knowing. Alright. The bottom of the day is co-create. I just, listen y'all. Because you got, look, a higher power. You got deep knowing, which is the high priestess. Co-create. That's a working together. And then a higher power. I don't know. Maybe somebody trying to build a dream team or something like that. But these folk don't want you in. And that's cool. But I feel like the problem is somebody does. I don't know where that rainbow is coming from. Y'all can't see this little rainbow right here. It's a reflecting of a glass or something. But anyway. There's somebody here that wants to collab with you. Here you are again, this little owl and this cheetah. So this is giving that hierophant energy. Whoever that person, that hierophant can be symbolic for one person or a group. They are already powerful as fuck. They feel as if they don't need your services, child. But someone does. Okay? It's you, the owl. It's you here, this owl. And with these columns, it's really giving that hierophant energy. I always think of like, y'all know the hierophant could be organizations. It can also be like a court or something like that. But yeah, this person, they don't feel like they need to work with you. What's the point? But somebody here feels like there's a higher power. Um, maybe this person feels if they were, if they put you with this group, it would be better. I don't know. Yeah, because see, somebody, look at that keyhole. I mean, it goes straight to the stars, child. That, that's somebody's third eye right there. But they, you know, if this is just one person, they want to do it by themselves. They don't want to work with nobody else, okay? 
If it's a group, they already got the people that they want. They don't want to add you. But I don't know who. Maybe it's someone above them who has a higher authority. Or something like that who wants to put you on this thing. Let me see. Uh-uh, I'll close with them. Let's pull these out. Yo, look. Whoever this is at their desk, this is you, the owl, okay? With this coffin, somebody could be trying to end. They don't want you with them, just period. I don't know how else to say it. And so they could be doing a lot to maybe make you give up or... Yeah, maybe I feel like it's a position of high honor. And the ace of pen this is the ace of pentacles, the gift, the offer. But somebody's trying to put an end to that. So they feel like maybe they are very good already. I don't know what this is, but some type of co-create, some type of um, collaboration here. Alright, what else, spirit? What else is going on for my collector? The house. So. Mm -mm. I'm just going to say. Whatever this is. is very guarded. It's very protected. Whatever this building is. It's very protected. Very protected. Okay. And there's a two on it. This is the higher thing. It's some type of organization or something like that, y'all. Main male. See, somebody want to be the only person. This, there's a one on this main male. So you could be a female. They don't, they don't need to work with you. They got this under control. <laughs> Whatever this is, okay? Maybe they've been doing it for a long time. Maybe this person has a lot of experience in whatever this is. And maybe they could feel like you just going to slow them down. Maybe they feel like, because you could be new at something, right? Maybe this person, you know how you, when you, okay, so say you are a manager at Burger King, and then they hire a cashier. That takes time out of your day, right? Because every time that cashier needs something, they got to call on you. That takes time away from what you got to do. I feel like this man and man feel like, man, uh-uh. It's, it's going to be more of a headache. It's going to be a headache. I could just... Oh, this person is saying they could just go get someone who's more experienced and or they could just do it by themselves. Okay? All right. What else? Because maybe you are new at something. But I feel like there could be some type of skill set that you have because there's a reason why you're even being thought of look 444 you are divinely guided and protected okay there's some reason why you're even being thought of okay maybe this main male has a different set of skills and so whoever is over them could be like hey man if you put your set of skills with this person's set of skills maybe it would be like the dream team but this person, they have been, I feel like they've been doing something by themselves for so long and they are motherfucking damn good at what they do. They remind me of um, the movie Bodyguard. This remind me of Kevin Costner. That's not for everybody, okay? They don't need no help. I, I said, child, you, you either knew, you, I feel like you knew it something and this person's like, uh-uh. Man, I ain't got time to be training nobody, looking after nobody. This is going to put me behind. This is what this person feels like. Okay. Yeah. Concern in this marriage is, I feel like, a partnership. They're concerned about this. Ooh. What? What? 
There's a okay, three, three, three. So you got four, 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 and three, three, three. You see, there's a three on this marriage card. For some of y'all, this person could be um it's I hope this is not the case, but it's kind of given. You know how say you're in a relationship with somebody and you you the boss and you hire a receptionist. And your spouse, if it's problems going on, it like fire her. You can't work with her. Or this person has somebody else in mind, somebody else that they wanted to work with. Cause there's a three up here. They had somebody else that they wanted to work with. It could be another male, could be another feminine. It's not you. But somebody else sees you as the person that should do this, okay? It could be some type of community. You could be joining. But at the end of the day, it's, up, it's ultimately up to you whether you want to do it or not. Because like I said, you didn't apply for this. You can't apply for this. You have to be recommended, okay? And um, with the poverty, it's like people doing everything they can to make you feel left out in the cold. You're not wanted. I'm telling you right now, they do not want you there. Just the fuck period. And it could be because you knew. I was watching the movie, What's Love Got to Do With It last night. And the part that stuck. You know how you, when you watch a TV, when you into it, if you get messages different ways. But when I'm watching TV, the volume could be on 20. But if it's something that I need to hear, it'll seem like the volume went up to 40. So when I was watching the movie last night, he said, uh, this is right when I hired Tina. Well, he already had his dancers and stuff, right? They had been there for a long time. And when, and, and one of the girls was like, yeah. And he want everybody to be nice to her and help her out. All of a sudden he got the case of the niceness. So maybe these people are supposed to be helping you out or working with you or something, but they're not. They make you feel left out in the cold car. They don't really want your ass on whatever this is. And that's just the truth, yeah. That's that same main female that that man was looking at on the thoughts card. And see, one to the two. But I just told you, this main male, you got main male, main female. This male wants to be by himself and or wants to work with someone else. It's, it, they don't want to work with you. But you are what somebody feel like would be the perfect thing. One to the two, okay? Courthouse, so this is about documents, contracts, things like that, okay? <laughs> so yeah, this person is definitely trying to make you feel out in the cold. It could have a great fortune involved, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, it's something to do with toil and labor. This person's also trying to make you work extra but some of y'all this this person could be taking the credit for something because the toil and labor is hard hard tedious work that you don't want to do so this person if they partner with you i'm telling you now they're going to give you the shit end of the stick <laughs> hello i don't know what this is where this job is this is a job okay if they hire you <laughs> You're going to be out there cleaning out the porta potties. <laughs> Hello? Yes. Because they already got their group of people. Or it's something like that with this community, y'all. For some of you, it's just a... Maybe this community is like an organization, right? And then they have... All right, so I'm going to partner you with this one, and I'm going to partner this one with that one. Because you think of the movie, Remember the Titans. Um, why, why? Okay, hold up, because I just got, there are 20, 20 highly capable Negro women in the West Computing Wing. I got that off that movie, uh, Hidden Figures, okay? Now, I'm getting the movie, Remember the Titans, when they went on, when this other coach came in, he already had his team. Okay, and he even said, we already got our players. We don't need yours. All right, but so that made two of each position. When Co Kogios had his team, and then when Denzel came in, he had his team. So that made two captains, two two positions. I don't know the name of them positions, y'all, the football, football position. But anyway, the coach said, look, man, 
the best player will play. The best player will play, right? But they didn't they wasn't playing together. They was acting like they was against each other. And so when they went to football camp, he said, Tell me something about your um uh, person next to you. They didn't know nothing about each other. So he said, Look, man. The person that you sit next to, oh, oh yeah, that part where they they rode in separate buses. The black coach and his kids was on one bus. Coach Yost and his kids on another bus. And um, this they were like, oh, no, nah. <laughs> bad, bad. Everybody off the bus. And then he told them, I think it was each position, sit like that. So ended up mixing up, right? And he was like, get comfortable because whoever I sit you next to, that's who you're going to be rooming with. And when and at first they were arguing, fussing, and fighting. But then, y'all know them two captains or whatever, they became like this. They, they was close as fuck. And he said, and this came out a little bit in my reading yesterday. He said the problem was that he feared him. Okay? But then they became best friends. You remember Jerry, the one who had the accident? Uh, what was his name? The other one. They, he looked at him as if, like, they was brothers. Like, my brother from another mother. His At first, his mama didn't want... The whole fucking town hated him and his players at first. Yet they did now. Go watch... Listen, go watch Hidden Figures. And go watch, uh... Remember the Titans. Give me some good-ass movies, okay? And so that's kind of what I'm getting with this little community. They already got their people. They don't need you. They don't want you. Um, so they might give you the shit end of the stick. Or something like that. Okay. What else? Uh -huh. Now, for a very few of you. For a very few of you. Look at this. That one to the two. That one to the two is this right here. That's for a bare few, okay? With high honor. <clears throat> Maybe someone ends up respecting the other, uh, respecting their determination, their resilience, their strength, or something like that, okay? That's not going to be for everybody. Because for the majority of you, they don't want you over here, and that's just the truth of it. getting that too. Somebody could want to work with their spouse. This could be the person that's over everybody. I have no idea. Somebody could want to work with their boyfriend or their girlfriend or their husband or their wife. I, mm. But maybe the choice isn't this person because the lovers is all about choices. I don't know. All right, what's this? Journey. So you come. Somebody's coming to the ending of something. There's a ten on this card. I, wa I wonder how this gonna play out because there's a line. There's a few tarot card readers. Remember, this is for my my uh, intuitives with the deep knowing. There's a few of y'all, but there's this light shining down on this individual right here. And I always point out this extra fabric that this person got. So, say out of a line of five tarot card readers, maybe you, say they all y'all do the same thing. Well, maybe you uh, have a different set of skills. For some reason, you was chosen for something. And it's causing some issues in your life. And there's something about a relationship that's causing problems in your life. And I feel like you are this child energy right here. You see this 18 with sim symbolize that you are grown, but um, naive when it comes to what the fuck is going on right here. Okay? Um, what else do we need to look at? 
I just kind of want to see how this going to play out for some. Y'all energy changes daily. But, uh. I feel like this was somebody in Mars. Remember, I was getting strength, resilience. You could be this empress right here, main female, okay? Somebody sees this in you and feel like you would go good with. This is probably an emperor. So if the main female is an empress, high priestess, this main male is probably an emperor, hierophant. Who could be a king of pentacles but they cause so many problems in your life because they do not want you here okay i don't know how else to say this they don't want you here them and um ooh, not a source to the magician but some of you it could be fear this devil energy here. But yeah, so if you've been feeling left out in the cold, a lot of chaos and conflict going on, this main male is causing that because they don't want this. There's something different about you, okay? There could be different races, different ages, different beliefs. But these two people need to co-create. They need to collaborate. They need to work together for whatever this, for the higher power, for the, what I'm, what I'm getting with the higher power is like for the greater good of everybody. These two need to collaborate. Um, I don't know. I feel like it's for this house, this building, whatever this building is symbolic to. Okay. But you, yeah, this person that causes, <laughs> baby, causing all kind of issues in your life. It's like they want you to give up. So through that five of ones, you showed your strength. And didn't even know where it was coming from. And for a lot of you, you did. That's why people was watching with the eight of ones, a lot of online watching, uh, a lot of people talking about something. See, this person sitting up here, they was competing with you instead of working with you. It was never supposed to be a competition. Main male, main female. They were supposed to co-create. It was never supposed to be in a competition. Yeah, I told you this about work with the Eight of Pentacles. And somebody could have chose, thank you, Spirit. Look, somebody could have chose this main male because of their skill set. And somebody could have chose you. But this person either wanted to work by themselves or they wanted to work with someone else something like that but remember i said somebody's going to only work with their best nine of cups to to the lovers they're choosing they're making the best choice out of this whole situation <coughs> yeah ace of cups somebody could be um very gifted this ace of cups is that deep knowing right and what I'm getting. I don't know what they do. But some of you, this person is in law. Take that high resume. But anyway, they're like, hell no, nah, this person going to be a headache. Every time, every time they need something, they got to ask me. I got to stop what I'm doing to help this motherfucker. I ain't got time for that. It's going to slow me up. And this is also somebody who don't like change, too. They feared you. That's what this was. Just like in the movie, um, Remember the Titans. They didn't like, they saw each other's talent, but they didn't like each other out of, well, what's his name? Julius. The black dude named was Julius. The one who had the accent, his name was Jerry, I think. Gary, Jerry. Anyway, Jerry was the one who said he feared Julius, but it really what. So, and you know, so what happens when an empress. Y'all need to watch my reading about the light. Okay? Just talked about this. And somebody else commented 
on one of my videos the same thing. When you meet an empress, most of the time what happens, or when you meet an earth angel, most of the time what happens, they're holding up a mirror. So you think you're seeing this person when you're really seeing yourself. Whatever this person was afraid of, it, it was they self. Maybe it was your strength they was afraid of. I don't know, child. Yesterday I was getting that somebody was afraid of your life. The sun with the ace of cups came out. It's fear. Not a one. That's what that is. But these people are supposed to be working together. And for some of y'all, they're supposed to have been helping you already. And they, they left your ass out there in the cold with the five of pentacles. I can't make it up. Ten of pentacles to the five of pentacles. They don't want they don't want nothing to do with you. All right, man, let me put some of these green cards. That's kind of messed up, man, but, hey. Yeah, it could have something to do with some type of leadership. But I feel like that's the higher thing. That's what I feel. For a lot of y'all, this was destined to happen. For some of you, this person was just trying to make you give up so they wouldn't even have to rule you out or <laughs> None. If you just give up and quit, then they can go on and work with the person that they wanted to work with and or they can work by themselves. But this card says, believe in your dreams and your passions. It's your calling to follow them. Whatever led you to this point, it was to direct you to a higher purpose. That's what I'm getting with the higher power, higher purpose for the greater good of all if these two people was to collaborate, okay? New exciting adventures await. Don't look back, only look to the future. Okay. I told you this person want to be by little independence. They want to work alone. So you may not get this offer. This person may not ever come to you and offer you anything. Because with this independence, that's not a pinnacle. This person want to be by themselves. They want to work by themselves. Cool. So why is the reading coming out? Arguments. It's five of wands. This was okay. I don't know why this because that's this marriage card. Somehow this opportunity is driving a wedge between two people. They're allowing it to. I don't know why. So it's kind of like um, let's take McDonald's. So you got a manager, right? And the manager says, I'm finna hire a lead cashier and a regular cashier. Well, the lead cashier is in a relationship, okay? The manager hires the regular cashier. The lead cashier has to train the regular cashier in their opposite sex. And maybe they're both attractive. And so it ends up causing problems in the lead cashier home life. That's what it looked like for somebody. It shouldn't be. Work at home should be two different things. Or the, maybe the, the issue is they was trying to get their person that job. And you came in and got it. Some shit like that, y'all. I don't know what this is. I don't Alright, what else, Spirit? So, you have goals, celebrating, planner. So, I'm not sure if you're going to be celebrating with this person or not because they're determined to be by themselves that's what it look like independence they're leaving you out in the cold but what what she said the other day one man's trash is another man's trash you will be celebrating with somebody and there may be an unforeseen increase in your income okay so for, uh, this card says don't let the world lead you take the steering wheel and uh, take control of your own life. And then this one. This is a great time to take financial inventory. See what needs to be changed. Careers and event planning. Project management or professional organizer. Could be just right for you. But when I get this card. I, I always pick up that. You go from. Maybe overlooked to booked. You could be getting booked on something else. Okay. That person who's supposed to work with you. They did. They they're not. I don't see them doing it. 
peacemaker. Money manager and charity. So this could have something to do with like humanitarian work. Peacemaker with leadership. in the past with options yeah many opportunities will come will become available to you do not get stuck in doubt when an offer presents because we saw that gift card which is the ace of pentacles there's some type of offer getting ready to come to you i don't feel like it's going to be from this main male like it, it was supposed to but they over here dealing with something or something else that's got they they feel like they can do better without this so there's going to be some some other kind of offer coming your way. Okay. Now, let me get a message from the higher self. Then we're going to close out with this angel. Shit, for a lot of you, by this person leaving you out in the cold, could have been what opened you up to all these other opportunities. Because somebody was supposed to work with you, and they left you out by your damn self. Now, because we saw the destiny card, maybe this was a uh, main male, main female. Maybe this was like a twin flame situation. This person chose to deal with some somebody else that they are now, you know, arguing with because there's a three on this card too. They chose someone else, right? Could be how it, how it, how it was, but I feel like it got something to do with work. <laughs> Right. Message from the highest self. Message from the highest self. Somebody aura is beautiful. Look at it. Oh my god. It's like the northern lights. That's what it look like. Believe in your dreams and your passions, child. Okay, so what is the message from the highest self? Yeah, for a lot of you, I don't think I don't see you getting no offer from this person, but from somebody else or some something else. Could be another job offer, could be another romantic offer. Because we saw courtship with the marriage card too. Something bit more your fit, more on your vibration. Message from the high self. Yeah, overcoming obstacles. That's the strength card with the Empress. Yeah, you can overcome anything. Maybe people set a lot of obstacles in your way. That big ass boulder could have been because of a lie or the shit. That's that five of ones, the things that these other people was doing because they didn't want you to, to, to do something. But in, in overcoming this obstacle may have caused some type of growth, right? To better prepare you for these opportunities that's coming through. All right, bottom of the deck. Yes, blessings are shining in your life. Remember that rainbow that I talked about at the very beginning? I don't even see it now, but it was right here. It is a rainbow of blessings showering in your life. Okay, now let's get an angel message. Let me clean this up right quick. <laughs> Spirit. I wouldn't want to be with nobody. I wouldn't want to work with nobody that didn't want to work with me either, right? Or I wouldn't want to be with nobody that didn't want to be with me either. Because for some of y'all, it wasn't work. It was romantic. Take it how it was going to resonate. <clears throat> now. What's going on? Angel messages for the collective. Angel messages for the collective. Thank you, Spirit. I just want to thank you, Spirit. Yeah, solar plexus shock. Hey, man, it's safe for you to be powerful and take charge of your life in positive ways. Look, and look at your aura, child. Look at it. Look at your halo. Yeah, because I told you now, if you'd have worked with that person, they'd have had you somewhere cleaning out porta potties and shit. 
Maybe you will be moving towards a space where you you, uh, you can shine and be nurtured. Okay. Yep. Giving and something. Yeah. Giving and receiving. Because I'm telling you, if you work with the other person or been with the other person, because maybe they have they have this mentality of one person has to be in charge or something like that. So if this was romantic, they were not going to treat you as an equal. <clears throat> Even though it said main male, main female. It was not going to treat you as no equal. Um, if this was a job, this person it was not going to have you where you should have been. They are going to have you over there. Just like in that movie, N with an E, that man was on the ships cleaning out the poop in the bottom of the ships. Um, during the little slavery time, well, th this white dude, instead of being his owner, they became best friends. He went down there and was cleaning out the shit with him. This person, when that's the giving and receiving, they wouldn't have worked with your ass. They, I'm telling them to get this shit in. Well, a lot of you, they probably would have put you in situations that would have, could have even been harmful to you. Okay? Because somebody was competing with you when they should have been working with you. So, anyway. Where you getting ready to go is some real giving and receiving. Now, be willing to forgive. Okay? Yeah, because spirit's all. That's what I was getting. <laughs> mm -mm -mm. Somebody respects this. That that strength with that empress. We acknowledge for your progress that, you, that you've made in remembering love in your daily activities. We can clearly see the contribution that you're making to the world through your thoughts, feelings, and actions of love. Okay, so it's like your hard work is about to pay off for you in a good collaboration. All right, that's what I got for y'all. I love y'all from the bottom of my feet. Till next time.